day when it comes to going outside with the allergies. I know it was a beautiful weekend, which means more suffering. Yes. That's, that's the downside when we get a dry stretch like we've had. And uh, yeah, pretty high pollen counts for the next few days. We see a little bit of a dip uh, tomorrow with a little better chance for rain, especially through, say, mid-morning through the afternoon. But uh, no big signs of relief when it comes to our pollen counts anytime soon. Uh, you're going to be sniffling and sneezing through this week. This morning we are dry, and again, that's going to mean the pollen count stays pretty high. It's a live view from Lincoln at Talladega Super Speedway. We are less than a week away from the big race. And of course, that comes on Sunday, the Geico 500 at Talladega Super Speedway. Big picture. A lot of cloud cover across the state of Alabama. You'd see some showers back across middle Tennessee, especially from Nashville and points north. Severe storms ongoing across parts of Nebraska and Kansas. For us today, the most you will see is just a sprinkle or two. Now, you can see a lot of green on the radar here. Most of what you're seeing here is just some ground clutter. There might be a couple of light sprinkles mixing in at this point uh, back southwest of Tuscaloosa at the moment. But for most of us today, you're not going to see rain, just a few clouds. Temperatures sitting in the 50s and 60s, 50s across East Alabama, 60s from I-65 and points west, where there's been a little bit more cloud cover to start things off this morning. Temperatures making it up into the 80s again today. Uh, I'll put the rain chance at 10%. I'm being generous here. Uh, you might see a sprinkle, but as far as measurable rain, that's not in the forecast today. It will be breezy today. Winds out of the south sustained at about 10 to 15 miles an hour. Some gusts climbing up closer to 20, maybe even 25 miles an hour in a couple of spots. You'll see in the future cast a lot of green popping up. We've got drier air near the surface, so it's going to be a struggle for this stuff to make it to the ground. But again, a sprinkle or two could mix in at some point today, mainly from mid morning, then a lull through middle of the day, and then a little better chance to see some of these showers make it to the ground this evening. Even still, we'll put only that rain chance at 20% for tonight. Not everybody seeing rain, but better rain chances on the way Wednesday. Scattered showers and storms likely. Thursday during the day mainly dry, but Thursday evening here comes some more scattered showers and storms. Friday and this weekend, more rain in the forecast. Hit or miss showers and storms are likely. Still, not a washout on any given day, but tomorrow and then again on Sunday, a better chance to see some of these showers and storms. Temperatures take a bit of a tumble this weekend. We'll be in the 70s on Saturday down into the 60s on Sunday. So we do see a drop in temperatures by this weekend and into the start of next week. But as far as really nice weather, we're going to have to wait till Monday before things really start to look nice out there. Ani. All right. Thank you.